Well, this is gonna be interesting. Well, hey there, I didn't see you there. Okay, let's uh, not do this. This is embarrassing. Okay, so like, they've made Bad Water Pro V7. Pro V7 is significantly different on the third point, and this is quite annoying for EU players because we like our long holds and not really pushing at all. So, EU has already done their games mostly on this, but I think in a few hours NA is going to do these, and you guys take UGC way more seriously than we do, so I might as well go over what I've learned from this point so you guys can quickly understand, just in case you need some strats. So firstly, having a sentry, this spot seems to be a pretty okay standard spot. People over there, like snipers, can spam you out really easily. You can kind of hold back people pushing from bridge house, but as soon as they take boiler, there, they can just spam you out really hard. This bit is kind of stopping you from having ye old dispenser trick. You can kind of put the dispenser here, and it will stop people come stop spies coming up. But they'll have to go all the way around here, so you can kind of like designate this area as a spy check zone. But I haven't seen many teams actually hold inside this house too well. You can have the classic sentry spot on here, which is pretty good for pubs. You can hold this there for boiler area. The problem is that a sniper can stand literally there, like at the end on boiler, and this whole like line over here is just a kill zone. So holding here very much relies on your soldier being able to keep the peace over there. You can also have your combo around, around here and have like maybe a dispenser over there for them. And also there's an interesting spot which I thought would be kind of funny, but I actually saw some teams run it. But basically, you do the dispenser trick. You, so you have a dispenser here, but then you also build a sentry here, watching the point. And because you've got these like two buildings next to each other, you've got like this kind of double dispenser trick going on. So people can't actually get up here. This kind of stops people from just walking up to the point and just walking over your team. It's really passive though. So like you're just giving a lot of like this area for free. So if you're already being pushed back, like for example you lose your heavy or your medic on second and you're quickly backing out, you can set up this and just sort of like have it make sure like just to see if no one like sees you have a setup there and then sort of have your combo a hold around here and you can kind of contest this area and play passive. The problem is as soon as they get like a solid jump up there, you're kind of screwed. So this can be kind of interesting with like, I like the idea of just putting two buildings here and keeping this there locked down. So maybe some team could come up with a way to make this work. But yeah, this is like what I found so far. Also, the normal sentry spot up there is really bad to do because before, like that little windowsill that was there, was really helpful. Like when you were building your sentry gun. Let me just head over over there. When you were building your sentry gun, the level one's like height was wasn't enough to actually shoot over there, so anyone coming from there wouldn't actually be seen. But when you level up your like sentry gun to like level two or level three the model actually gets taller a little bit, so it can see over that. So it's only about on like level 3. I think it can on level 2, just like the people over there. But you need to get it onto level 3 before it can actually start shooting people. So that gave it like a lot of smaller of like a hitbox to be able to hit because of that wall. But now that there's no wall there entirely, it can just get spammed out so easily. You could probably put a sentry here, and then maybe put your dispenser trick here if you want to try and do the classic hold and see how that works but honestly i think this is just too dangerous you can have like they could just put a soldier down there by the ramp and just spam out this gun so easily and you're going to take a lot of splash damage because there isn't a wall yeah this see what you guys can like make from this peace